Well, Peter Morgan joins us, and Pete, we'll start with Star Rolling. Well, gee, he was impressive this morning. Yeah, Richard, he surprised me a bit. I, you know, we told uh, Gaz to sit off him a little bit and then uh, perhaps blow him away in the straight, but uh, it didn't quite happen that way, and uh, I was a bit surprised about that. We, last time we seen him, he was terrific, winning over 2,000 metres at Flemington. You've given him a little spell, uh, but he, he certainly looks fit. He had a three-week break, um, never grew a coat all through winter, and he still hasn't, and... Uh, he came back in out of the paddock if he'd never been turned out and uh, you know, he, that's probably his first serious gallop this morning and, uh, and no, it was fantastic. You've, you had nominated him for both the 1500 metres and the 1200 here at the Valley on Saturday but the 15 looks pretty hot. It does look hot and we're about 28th in order and I don't think we'd get a run and uh, we'd probably uh, run him in the 1200 to, uh, you know, he's got to go somewhere so the 1200 would probably be his race and uh, then uh, we'll try and get him into the Heatherly. That'll uh, be they're the aspirations and then try to yeah. sneak in the back door for some of the, the big races? Yeah, we're sort of looking at it that way, but we're not we're not going to be desperate. I think you know, he's probably a horse that'll be better in the autumn. So uh, he's, I know he's four-year-old, but uh, you know, he's worth looking after. Lucky Penny, when you look at her form, just doesn't it look good? Last start beaten point two of a length from Linton, who went out and won a group one next start. Yeah, well, unlucky that day because I think after the winning post we were back in front again. And uh, I mean, she trialled fantastic. And uh, you know, as I said, I thought she'd probably blow him away this morning, but that didn't quite happen. Okay. Now, what's her plans uh, moving forward through the spring? Well, her mission is is the uh, is the mire, but she'll probably run sad day in the 1200 mares, and uh, then she'll probably go to the Let's Elope. 